What's up guys, what's up? How's everybody doing? Snowed last night as you can see from this little thing here. It snowed a little bit, but not too bad. I'm just gonna use these blocks. These came from the raised bed project I just finished. So I'll pop a little link in there if you wanna watch that. I'm gonna just gonna pull these off here and we'll be burning these up. I might keep pieces like that maybe, but for the most part, all this is going back into the garden. I'm a big time fan of recycling and reusing stuff. And this can turn into ashes, which I will be using in the garden to raise my soil pH and to make my plants just that much happier. Some good stuff there. There we go. That'll be fun. I'll have a little campfire pretty soon here. Friends, we are on an adventure of discovery. We're out to go find some pieces that I've been looking for for these seats for my fire pit area. Seats are gonna be awesome. I'm on a trip to go find an adventure to go find these pieces that I've been looking for. I'm really wanting to make these beautiful seats on top of the, I've already have the frame of the seats around this fire pit that I've made, but I really wanna go ahead and get pieces to create a nice uh, a top there. I was gonna get flagstone, get the flagstone and cut the pieces up with a saw, but then I was thinking, you know, we can get more creative with this and put some different pieces together to make it just a nice, beautiful, you come up to the fire pit and these seats are just welcoming. You sit down on the seats and the fire is roaring, warm and toasty. It's gonna be awesome. So let's go get those pieces, see what we can find and have a fun time at it. We're out here with all these stones. Look at these cool things. They're looking good, looking good. Man, awesome. Before we go look for those pieces, I gotta find some stones that I'm gonna be using to build next week, early next week. We're gonna be making a stone uh, bed border around somebody's front yard. So let's look at these, see if we wanna use any of them and the prices and all that. I like the looks of this. See how they're all about, about two inches thick. And then when you stack them, they're gonna be, you know, about that wide, about a foot wide, maybe 10 inches. So those are looking good for stack stone. Looking good, looking good. These are big, too big. Too big, too big, too big. Yeah, all that stuff's too big. These right in here are the best options. Yeah, it looks like that's already been broken. It's already taken some out of it. I like this one. Good. That one looks good too. I'm gonna go in there and see if I can find some more cool pieces. Got some good pieces here. These smaller ones will be on the ends, on each end. And then these big guys will be the, the main sitting area. So yeah, I'm gonna go in there, go pay for them, I'll be right back out. We're headed out again, and right over there where those guys are, I went ahead and chose one of those pallets of the field stone. Boom, went over there. So that's gonna be awesome. That'll be a future project next week, putting in like a, you know, a stone border on the landscape. Good times, good times. We're gonna drop these stones off at the job site, and we won't be doing that work yet, but we'll go ahead and drop them off. Boom, there they are. Let's offload these things. Snag this thing. Not so pretty. Right, look at that. Nice on the edges and the top. So pretty. All right, here we go. Boom, there it is, whoa. Here, Ashton, hold the camera for me, please. 
Now we still have to polymer extend this in and it's going to take a little bit to do that because there might be some work that needs to be done on the pool plus it has to be a certain temperature to be able to actually set in so we won't be able to mortar these in with that with that polymeric sand quite yet but for the most part the project has been completed other than that part so and other than mortaring these in but let me show you these seats so we brought these over looking snazzy you like them Ashton? oh I love them man oh dude it's awesome so pull around here you can see the other end you know these will all be mortared in underneath will be put down mortar and y'all remember back here we we filled in with the scraps from around the the work site so that there's no wastage there try not to waste it all and then these stones even came from this job site so they already had them here so it's pretty cool that most of this project or a big majority of it was actually recycled and reused from on site so I, I like that aspect of it um, so yeah these are nice they have this chiseled edge so we got this chiseled as edge here that's going to be looking nice and then same here here so yep the chiseled edge will feel better on you know like your your knees there then doesn't, doesn't like cut into them so that's going to be nice these pieces over here same thing got a lot of fun character to each piece that's one thing i like about this whole install is you know we have stones that all, have all kinds of different character to them they're not just cut and dry you know so fire pits ready to go it's gonna be awesome got these these uh, pea gravel it's more like small river rock feels good it's not like slipping around i don't like that very very small river rock that stuff just slides everywhere and you end up kicking it in everywhere. It would have ended up in the pool, which is not good. But this is staying still, which I like. Then we have all of our flagstone over here. Same thing, and then we got our walkway. Kaboom, kaboom, kaboom. That's fun, we're gonna mortar them in a little bit later. And when we do that, we'll go ahead and clean up everything up and really finish the job right. And we'll do like a fun little video of like the grand finale. All right, y'all. See you next time. Good times, good times.